One million of them now have insurance and their families have it. Their families have it because what happened, whether it was Agent Orange or burn pits, they're all being covered now. And he opposed, his group opposed that. We're also in a situation where we have great respect for veterans. My, spent, my son spent a year in Iraq living one next to one of those burn pits, came back with stage four glioblastoma. I was recently in, in, in uh, France for D-Day, and I spoke to all about those heroes that died. I went to the World War II cemetery, World War I cemetery he refused to go to. He was standing with his four-star general, and he told me, he said, I don't want to go in there because they're a bunch of losers and suckers. My son was not a loser, he was not a sucker. You're the sucker. You're the loser. President Trump? Uh, first of all, that was a made-up quote, suckers and losers. They made it up. It was in a third-rate magazine that's failing, like many of these magazines. Uh, he made that up. He put it in commercials. We've notified him. We had 19 people that said I didn't say it. And think of this. Who would say I'm at a cemetery or I'm talking about our veterans? Because nobody's taking better care. I'm so glad this came up and he brought it up. There's nobody that's taken better care of our soldiers than I have. To think that I would, in front of generals and others, say suckers and losers. We have 19 people that said it was never said by me. It was made up by him, just like Russia, Russia, Russia was made up, just like the 51 intelligence agents are made up, just like the new thing with the 16 economists are talking. It's the same thing. 51 intelligence agents said that the laptop was Russia disinformation. It wasn't. That came from his son, Hunter. It wasn't Russia disinformation. He made up the suckers and losers, so he should apologize to me right now.